Hey everyone, it's an aging zombie here bringing you some more Modern Warfare Zombies content. In today's video, I'm going to go over how to unlock the Volt. Now, I know a lot of people probably know about this already, uh, and I have seen how to do it in other videos, and I've wanted to do it, I just have been focusing on the camo grind. But I just had a match where, as I was going for serpentine camos, uh, a mimic threw me under the map. So I've lost everything. So I thought maybe, hey, the vault might be a good way to do like a bit of a regain. And for those that haven't seen how to do the vault, maybe you learn something. So let's get into this. Okay, so, ooh, one of the things that we need to do is right there. So let's go run over here really quick before I go over to the vault and show it off. Let's hope this guy doesn't beat me to it. I don't know what to make of it. All right, so the first thing you have to do is interact with this phone here. Oh, hello. Never seen the disciple over here. Oh, more zombies. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I don't have a self revive at all. The zombies <laughs> underground there. Thank you. Reloading. Yep. Okay. Oh, there's just a bunch of plates in here. My goodness. Okay. So now we have the first thing out of the way. And I survived. All right. So the vault is under Shahan Manor here. So let's head over there. And I'll show you kind of what it's about. Now, normally, from my understanding, that first phone that you have to interact with, the send, to H send the signal to H7, shouldn't have a boss of any type. So that was kind of wild. All the other stuff that you have to do, there's mercs that you have to fight. So not necessarily bosses. Bosses was kind of a bad word. So not really bosses that you have to fight, but mercs that you have to fight um, that are all named. So there's like the Rook, the Knight. And I forget the name of the last one. Um, now the Knight you've probably seen driving around. He's the one that drives around, not in the convoy. He just drives around by, well, in a single vehicle with some other mercs in there. And then I think the Rook is that sniper that is perched up in a building. Yeah, I forget the name of the last one, but it's all related to chess. And you'll see once we get to the Volt. All right, so the Volt is under here under this building. Now, there's a couple ways to get here. To get it, like, down the stairs. So you've got zip line here. And head on this way. And then the other spots, you can come in down here on the coastline, and also there's a pipe that leads in underground. So this is the vault. And if you see, there's these lights up top that correspond to things you have to do. So one of them, one of the lights is the thing we did up top here. The other one is the knight that drives around. So someone already killed the knight and interacted with the phone. Which is kind of a bummer. I was hoping to get that done as well. But let's go try and do the other two. So the other two is the sniper that I talked about, which is here. So he's up in this building. And then the other one, I don't know if anyone has ever driven through here. Oh, here's a zombie. Nope. Oh. Uh, driven through here, and that smoke pops up, and then there's those mercs. So that merc is the last one, and I forget the name of him. Uh, is that a bishop? I can't remember. I don't remember my chess pieces. So let's go... 
see what we can do here. Well, I need that. Okay, so I did see a guy over here earlier. Oh, good. He's still here. Uh, I was going to say, I saw another person over here. Was hoping he didn't kill him. All right, so let's get in this building. Now, I have killed this guy before, uh, not knowing what he was tied to. So I know this place is booby-trapped with a bunch of bouncing beddies. So you do got to be careful, especially since I don't have a self-revive. Oh, I thought that explosion was his Betty. Okay, so I think he should be in here. Oh, yep, and the sentry gun. Oh! <laughs> Betty's. See where? Oh, there you are. All right, so got you. Oop. Oh, whatever. All right, so send transmission to H7. So that should be the third light activated. So let's just kind of finish looting up in here. Uh, I'm actually going to drop this because I want to... Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, gosh. And also, if you know the... Uh, if you know the pattern to shoot on these, I believe these take you straight to the vault. I just don't know the pattern on it, so... Not going to do it. Okay, so let's go to the last guy and let's hope that he is still there. So to this tunnel. Okay, so this one is one of those recon mercs that sprint at you and just beat you down really quick. And since there's usually smoke that spawns when he spawns, I might kind of wait for the smoke to dissipate before I try and battle him. So let's... uh. I'm sure I could drive him over, but let's not do that. Okay, so some grunts. There's the bishop. Oh, but I have no ammo. <laughs> okay, mercenary critical. Okay, was that him? Ah! Please don't die. Okay, ammo. Okay. Okay, I must have killed him, right? Oh yeah, the phone's there. All right. Any durable gas masks? I'd like a durable gas mask, please. Okay, send a. Oh. Send H seven. <laughs> Okay, so now let's head back to the resort. Okay, let's hope no one just happened to walk by and see that it was open. Okay, good. So no one's opened it. So as you can see, all the pieces are knocked over. And it's a bummer I didn't get to fight the knight. But, you know, that's okay. So let's get in here. Locked. I thought you could unlock it now. Oh, here. Hold on. Unlock the vault. Cool. And 
I do know one of these is supposed to be a mimic. Probably this one. No? No? Ooh, cool. Yeah, there we go. Need that large rucksack. Oh, yep. Oh, God. Oh, this gun is terrible. Oh, and he's like an HVT level boss. Whoop. All right, got to be a little more mobile. Oh, no. Please don't put me through the wall and <laughs> into the ground again. open hopefully yeah oh boy that was more of a fight than I thought it was gonna be <laughs> well the nice thing is I got a large rucksack out of that I was hoping for a three plate as well but that's actually fairly easy from uh, the strongholds you just go to a camp and then to a stronghold Okay, what else? Did I miss anything? Nope. All right. Well, there we have it. The volts, you know, yeah, it's pretty easy. Uh, I was hoping for a little bit more as far as a comeback would go. I think the steps that you have to do to unlock every to unlock everything and then come down here and fight that guy, you know, it'd be nice if like a reward rift opened up like you did a contract. Even those reward rifts don't really give you too much, but still kind of fun to do. Yeah. All right, well, let's go get a three-plate vest now. Well, time's up. Reinforcements are outside looking for parking. Shit, they're moving fast. Prep for engagement, people. Oh, don't you worry. I'm prepped. Check out this preparation. Get them at their spawn point. Alrighty, three plate it is. Alright, so outside of a durable gas mask I'm pretty much back to what I was so let's go work on getting that now let's see let me first complete a contract because I need not only essence for it I figure I'll just buy one I have no idea the way the best way to make sure you get a durable like I don't know you know like oh go here this person always drops a durable or anything like that. Maybe, oh, maybe, uh, oh, what's the legacy? Maybe legacy does. I bet legacy does. But I don't want to go do that. Also, does anyone think some guns just, like, mess with the spawn rate of ammo from zombies some guns i just feel like i am consistently low on ammo like i haven't seen an ammo pack drop in a while so i feel like the ff fr 556 this gun is just terrible for ammo drop no ammo what the heck no ammo i don't know anecdotal evidence Probably. 
Oh, Mangler. I think that's it. Oh, it wasn't. Oh, yes. Oh, poor yells. Oh, the camo grind is finally over. Now I can just play the game. By a juggernaut while I'm at it. Okay, well, I have successfully regained, finally completed the vault. Relatively, right? <laughs> Didn't have to fight the knight, but uh, at least was able to get in there. So I think it's time to just get out of here. Got everything I need. Well, there we have it. The vault. I'd say for the effort it takes to open the vault, the rewards are not really worth it. Uh, especially as a means of regain. I think it's easier to just regain out in the field. Uh, I mean, the steps to open the vault are not hard. Like, they're not hard at all. And since anyone can complete them, you might not even have to do everything yourself like I did since I didn't have to fight the knight. Uh, but the loot just isn't great for the effort. And I, who knows, maybe I just had a bad roll of the die for the loot pool when I went in there. But either way, it's great to have Borealis done. And I hope everyone enjoyed the video. Till the next one, peace.